next eyeball. What's up, Anartax? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're back playing on X Life, and in today's video, we're gonna be building our Secret Santa's gift. And we're also gonna be doing a riddle hunt on the server. I figured since it's Christmas time that I should give everybody a present, even though we did do Secret Santa, I still wanted to do something else. So basically, I drew some cute artwork for everybody and I'm gonna hide it around their house and leave a riddle for them to try to find it. Before we get into all that though, <laughs> um, there is something outside my house and I, I, um, I kind of know what it is. <laughs> so the other day I was live streaming on Twitch and I decided to come on the X Live server just to kind of do a few things. And I found a tree, but then Joel signed on to the server. Um, and basically this is what happened. So yeah, I kind of know what this is. And at first, I thought it was a prank. I was going around everyone's houses looking for trees because I was like, who is building trees everywhere? But it turns out it is not a prank. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Joel was my secret Santa. Yep, Merry Christmas slash Jeremyism day pushed me from secret. Okay, well, before we open it, I wanna take a good look around it. Let's see. We have a giant green present with a blue bow. I love the blue bow, thanks, I really appreciate it. It's my favorite color, I don't know if you know that, but it is and I like it a lot. Is there anything on the back side? No, okay, okay. So this is just a giant cube with potentially a tree inside, unless he changed it, I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, are you ready to see what is in the box? In three, two, one. <gasps> Whoa! Oh. <laughs> For your secret Santa slash Jeremy gift, I have decided to give you your own reenaction of the day Donkey Jeremy was born. Along with this scene, you also get a real life Donkey Jeremy and some hand drawn figures of the people who were there. <gasps> oh my god, is that Jack's eyeball? We have Lizzie, we have Donkey Jeremy, we have Joel. <laughs> We have Callum. Oh my god, look at Jimmy. And look at Megan. Oh, this is beautiful. For those of you who may not understand, uh, this is basically like the birth of Jesus, but in Jeremy. <laughs> Hello, little baby Jeremy. This is amazing though. I love the tree. Everything is so cute. I think I'm actually gonna keep this here, but I might, I'm gonna get rid of the giant gift box because it's a little large. <laughs> From taking down the box, I just noticed all the floating stars. That is so pretty. Technically, I also got a gift of like a bunch of building blocks, which will be very useful for when I build my secret Santa through a present. Speaking of my secret Santa, we're gonna be heading over to Scott's house to build him something from World of Warcraft. For those of you that do not know, World of Warcraft is Scott's favorite video game and he loves the character Jaina. So I found some really cool pixel art online and I'm gonna try my best to recreate it in Minecraft. Before we go, I would just like to clean up some of the clutter that I have around my property. So we'll get rid of that crafting table. We'll get rid of this chest over here. And then there's another chest over here that we opened up last time from Joey. Now that I've opened up my secret Santa gift and cleared up my space, a bit. Let's head on over to Scott's house. Okay, so we have arrived at Scott's house, but we have to find a pretty big empty spot for the thing that I want to build. Also, I see someone has removed their Valentine's Day decor, but they ate the cake. But let's see, the pixel art is pretty big. Maybe we can put it up back there behind his house. That would kind of be a good spot. It's gonna be pretty tall though, so hopefully he doesn't mind. If anything, if he hates it, he could just destroy it and I won't feel bad, it'll be totally okay. <laughs> okay, now that we have the land scouted, it's time to build.
Okay guys, the Jaina build is complete and it looks heckin' cool. Look at that. Can we see it if we go on the rainbow bridge? Haha, <laughs> yep. Wait, no, that looks so cool. Okay, well, let's just leave a sign right here that says Merry Christmas. And then we'll put a sign on his board that says, look behind your house from Secret Santa. So hopefully he'll spawn in his house or something and he'll see the sign and then turn around to see Jane's little face. Okay, well now that I've delivered my secret Santa gift, it's time to give gifts to everyone else. I made a list of people on the server that are still active or at least semi-active. I drew a bunch of cute pictures and uh... I'm gonna hide them. None of my riddles or messages are gonna be difficult. I'm just gonna make it pretty easy and fun to find. And since we're already at Scott's house, let's start here. Okay, so let's see. Where could we hide a chest? Wait a minute. Does Scott still have the holes poster in his room? <gasps> oh, it's over here now. Okay. For those of you that were not there on Scott's stream, you, you would have no idea why I did this, but... I did this. I made this for Scott one day while he was streaming. It's beautiful. And I think I want to put a chest right below it with his gift inside. So these are all the drawings that I made for everyone. And this is what Scott's looks like. It's so cute. And he's holding a little candy cane. We're going to put this in the chest. Okay, so I wrote, find your gift. I heard you like holes. From Catherine. P.S. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I capitalized the H in holes to hopefully get him to understand that I'm talking about the movie and not just like a random hole in the ground. But if he can understand this message, he will go to the poster in his room and find his present. Okay, now next is Flip, and he has so much going on, I'm not sure where to put this one. Wait a minute. Has Flip ever seen the statue that I built him? I actually don't know if he's seen this. He's had to have known this is here, right? I think it would be funny if he was like holding his gift, even though, you know, it's not really holding it. But look, this is the little flip drawing. It's so cute. And it looks just like his little statue. I wrote, it's in your hand. Uh, hopefully he's not just sitting here like looking at his own hands like what? So we'll see. We'll see what happens with that one. Okay, Merry Christmas flip. Oh my god. I just had the best idea for Jack. Since Jack has a beanstalk, we could put the gift up there. So let's fly all the way up and we'll place it right in the middle of the beanstalk. So this is what Jack's drawing looks like. The candy cane actually goes very well with his skin. His place is just, um, is the word cluttered? I'm gonna use the word cluttered. I, I don't see the announcement board, so I'm gonna make something stick out to make sure he sees it. Okay, for his sign, I wrote, so that's why Jack climbed up there. Okay, so next we have Jem, and I remember she had a dog house around her house, right? Yeah, there's a dog house right here with a bone next to it. I'm just gonna move this flower over here for now, and I'm gonna put a chest right in front of the dog house. So here is Jem's art with the little candy cane. Okay, I couldn't really think of the best kind of phrase or confusing message to leave behind, uh, so I, I just simply wrote, I think your dog is hungry. <laughs> Okay, next we have Joey. Let's see, we could put it in his castle, maybe in his tree, but I think I wanna put it up in the magical bunny hat. Let's go ahead and hide this right behind one of the bunny ears. And this is what Joey's picture looks like. And now we just have to leave him a vague message. Okay, so for Joey's clue, I wrote, can you hear the magic? Because it's behind a magic bunny ear. I thought that was really cute. But okay, now that Joey is done, let's head on over to Callum's place. Okay, now Callum also has a lot going on around his house, but I kind of want to put it inside the snowman. Is this hollow? Uh, it is. Well, I'll just stick it on top. And before I write out his phrase, this is what his well drawing looks like. Look at that little fox. All right, in you go. I don't think Callum has an announcement board either, so I will make it stand out. Okay, and now this sign reads, do snowmen have brains? I feel like that one is really easy, so if he doesn't find it, I, I will be a little disappointed. But anyway, next on the list is Jimmy. Okay, now for Jimmy's gift spot, I kind of already know where I want to put it. Since he died to a crab, I still think that's really funny. So I want to put his present by the crabs. Let's pop it down right behind here. And before I put the painting inside, I want to show you what it looks like. Everybody, this is Jimmy. <laughs> and now we'll put down a sign that says, 
this really killed you? <laughs> Why does Quig have cobblestone going to the sky? Interesting. Well, what does he have going on in here? Why is there a chicken in a glass case? Sir, are you okay? Maybe that's where it should go. Okay, I have put the chest in the chicken hole. And this is what's going inside. And now I will put this back. And this time our sign will say, Jeremy likes Christmas too. Because the chicken in the hole is named Jeremy. All right, next up we have Lizzie and I have the perfect plan. We're gonna go over to her haunted stables and we're gonna put a chest right back here. Now this is what Lizzie's drawing looks like. So let's just put that in the chest. And I'm leaving a sign that says, I would hate it if you couldn't find it because hay is for horses and the horses are in the stables. I actually don't think there are any hay bales around the dead horses, but uh, hopefully she understands the pun. But now the last person I'm delivering a gift to today is Joel. Oh, you know what I wanna do? Where's Donkey Jeremy at? Doesn't he live up here? Hello, I'm gonna put a chest down in this corner. This is what Joel's painting looks like. And let's go leave him a sign by his house. Okay, so since I left the gift in Donkey Jeremy's pen, I simply wrote the one, the only. Okay, well now that we've finished delivering everybody's presents, I think that's gonna be it for today's video. Let me know in the comments which painting you like the best. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll see you next time. Bye!